Hey guys, welcome to another video. How are you guys doing? If you're new, hey, do not forget to smash that subscribe button. And if you're a returning subscriber, mwah, thank you so much for coming back. I really, really appreciate it. So today I'm excited because we're about to film what I love to film. The TBR Jar Picks My Month Read monthly read last month was a very very good month i'm not going to lie i planned to read a lot of books on my kindle and i did just that guys i read maybe three physical books uh, i'm currently reading one right now so that's gonna make it four because obviously the month is not over so i should finish it i should and then on my kindle i read about maybe maybe like 12 or so anyway that's besides the point i'm going to just do all this in my wrap up video so today let's pick up my tv round. i'm going to be using the tv round jar as usual i'm so excited i don't know how many books i'm going to be picking so let's just start already okay so before i pick this i need to tell you you know the books that i wrapped with my junior brother these ones here i've not read the one for march and the one for february so both of them are here right now <laughs> that's ace of spades and lessons in chemistry these two books i've not read them Actually, I've read 30 pages of this, but I really like it. It's not like I don't like it, but something else just caps, catch my attention and I'm reading on that book and yeah, yeah, yeah. So these two are going into my April TBR. Of course, these two, they are must. So let's pick, let's pick. A romance book. Okay. A romance book. A romance book. <laughs> oh, I know. The Right Move by Liz Stumford. I'm picking this because I read Mile High. And which is contrary to other people's opinion. They don't like my hype, but I do. I love it so much. And since this seems to be everybody's favorite, so apparently I feel like I would love this. Uh, and it's romance between Ryan and Stevie's friend, the flight attendant girl, yeah? So, let's pick another one. A book you want. Wow, any book I want. <laughs> I've never seen this kind of... <laughs> prompt before i've never picked a prompt like this a book i want i want by myself ah this is a good day it's a new life this is difficult <laughs> that ideal prompt is actually unfair because there's so many books i want they are my books so i, I just go with this one's card by emily mcintyre i read hooked last month not last month in march i really liked it it's you know dark romance so this is a lot of people's favorite and it's a lion king's kind of retelling vibes so i'm excited about this one. Oh my god these two books i've already picked are actually big <laughs> i didn't think about it okay another prompt let's do this right let's do this right a book set in a different continent basically a different continent any continent aside from africa is a different continent because i'm in africa of course but that's like virtually any book but i think i know what i want to pick killer instincts by jennifer limbans i read the naturals in march and this is the second book and it's set in new york i think it's new york or london one of the two sure i'm not sure but it's another continent entirely so i think this would be nice for that prompt let's go for another one oh, this one is fat i'm so scared <laughs> the shortest book wow the shortest book on my tbr the shortest book okay okay so i'm picking this one empress of the world by sarah ryan um this was a present from patience uh she just added it to my books and it's just 200 and 213 pages i don't know what it is about but i think it's really really cool the hypothesis is taking an actual class in archaeology will serve to comfort nicola Lance lancaster in her long lifelong dream of becoming an archaeologist reality an entirely different story and then there's another synopsis that is really really long that i don't want to read but i think this would be actually be nice it's quite short another word i'm not picking any of the rap books this month uh, let's see a book with a three-word title three-word title so this was among my match TBR, but I was not able to get to it. 
the marriage class and this is three words the marriage class three words so i'm going to be taking it into april it's one class 10 couples and 10 decisions honestly it's a niger it's by a nigerian author and it was sent to me by the author herself which is actually really cute but i can't wait to actually get into it so yes we've picked six hmm? wait one two three four five five books two books oh my god <laughs> let's do maybe 10 so i can have options a book your friend picks oh my god let me get back to that one let's pick another front a ku book oh my god now that my ku has expired <laughs> it's so funny my ku expired some days ago and now i picked the ku book so let's just go through the ku books i have here so that's it uh, i think i'll pick that sick love by jessica all yeah i'll pick it because i've been trying to get to this book but i'm not and it's still here how many more books to go at this rate i could pick all the old prompts and pick books for them because it's exciting to do this <laughs> a book with a purple cover purple 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 there's so many books here oh. family lore i actually bought this book because of the cover basically even underneath is also but is this purple or blue at this point i'm even confused because it wants to look like blue and it wants to look like purple it's hard to get purple okay so that is one two three four five six seven eight nine let's pick one more prompt a book with love on the title oh i have two books for this love and other words by christina lauren and i also have from look of with love these two books have love on the title oh uh, guys honestly a friend of mine read this i think it's also oki romance yes it's oki romance yes and it's also slow born i've not read anything by mariana zapata so this is going to be my first book by mariana zapata Hey, Mariana Zapata, if I pick this. My friend read it recently and she said she's in love with it. But Love and Other Words has been on my TBR since last year. Last year. And <laughs> I'm like, why am I not reading this? What is wrong with me? So I'm turned between these two. Slow Born or Second Chance Romance. Okay, so let me just give Christiana Lauren another... From Look Up With Love. Okay, I'm going to read From Look Up With Love because I don't know. There's one more book I'm adding to my TBR for April that I didn't even pick in this video and it's um, this one, Good Girl, Bad Blood. I was supposed to body read this with my friend, Tosin. So tell me which one is going to be on your TBR for the month of April. Let me know how it's going and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Deuces. Month, but I mean, do I have books? I'm these two books <laughs> using a uh, good belt good card by emily mcintyre a romance book it looks purple looks blue it's confusing jesus i feel like i cannot read all these books anyway oh my god do not fall it fell whatever i don't know what i'm saying